Humans are extremely dramatic. Every time we're frustrated, we make it known. We groan, moan, and whine. But it turns out humans aren't the only ones. Plants do this too. Plants have been known to cry. There's a new report. Here is our story on this. It seems like Roald Dahl was right. If you hurt a plant, they scream. Well, mostly. It's nothing like our angry mumble when someone eats the last slice of pizza. But plants have their own way of showing stress and frustration. They make a popping noise. It comes from tubes inside plants. Tiny bubbles burst inside them and produce mini shock waves. Kind of like what happens when we crack our knuckles. We can't detect these plant sounds with our ears alone. And this is not the only way plants show stress. Frankly, they are quite dramatic. They release powerful aromas and even change their colour and shape. These changes can thankfully be detected by humans. So did you know that their plant neighbours also notice this? These changes signal danger to them. So they boost their own defences. Even attract animals so they can deal with pests that may be harming the plant. And most importantly, they can start screaming too. These sounds are correlated with the kind of bad day that plants are having. Like if they are dehydrated or have had their body parts chopped off. And these noises can be heard many feet away. The question is, how do we learn to listen to our plants? After all, plants are the new pets. And we do care. Unfortunately, if you aren't a fancy scientist, you can't. Yet, but not to worry, research is still underway. And for now, all we can do is live with the reality of screaming plants. And the fact that we know this now. So next time you're mowing your lawn, remember that thousands of tiny grass leaves are screaming for that piece of information. Sorry, not sorry. 